All right, welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV. It is time once again to hit that main story quest line. And look, there he is. He's on my shoulder this time. He want to be all up in the conversation. On the counter offensive, Lieutenant Isendon wishes to share a report with you concerning the Garlemians' movements. Some experience and some gill. We'll be keeping a close eye on the Garlemian garrison. And to what seem, the Imperials have finally begun to mobilize. According to the reconnaissance report that just came in, squads even seen leaving the Castrum are too few in number to be effectively taken hold our position. They will likely mount a swift assault and focus on the acquisition of resources. I have, of course, also shared this report with the Crystal Braves there decided to take to the field to meet this assault head on. I will praise your fellow scions of the situation. And I'm heartened to know that they will be joining the effort. Pray report to Lieutenant Eleni and let your much welcome strength or lend your much welcome strength to the counter offensive. Alright boys and girls we're going to battle. There is no other gender. So, sorry if you're offended. Not sorry. Alright, Eleni. Glad to have you with us, Tickman. As I'm sure Lieutenant Eldenstein has explained, the Garleans have deployed a small force from Castrum Meridian. Their main column assembles to the north near Dalaman Talons, but we've also spied several squads attempting to conceal themselves on approach to the west. They wish you to rush forth and commit to battle with the main column, leaving the detached force free to raid the plant and pillage supplies. Not much of a strategy, but these are dis desperate men. Captain Elbrick. Greetings, Sion. I understand the commander bids you and your fellows come lend a hand to the Braves. With such mighty heroes at its disposal, the force should have little trouble contending with aught the Garleans might throw at them. But even you cannot be everywhere at once. The third was getting restless hold up in Utah, so I marched them out here to fill any holes in the plant's defenses and add their numbers to your counterattack. The reinforcements are welcome. We have enough soldiers now to divide our own forces and safely engage the enemy far beyond the walls. Aye, it would be best to avoid staging battle anywhere near this much cerulean. Let's take the fight to the Garleans. A wise course indeed, I shudder to think of the consequence should any of those storage tanks be exposed to fire. If there are no objections, the signs shall join the fourth and give battle to this main column. Everyone's in agreement. You're with the third thin warrior of light. Your job will be to intercept these squads holding out in the west and prevent them from reaching the processing plant. When you're ready to proceed, report to Lieutenant Yu Yu Hayes. His scouts should have a rough idea of where the Imperials have concealed themselves by now. Awesome. Got it. She's got a gigantic axe. Like we need to summon our blood paw. This paw is getting a little bit too clean, so we need to bloody them up a little bit. You Hayes, boarding for duty. A pleasure to be fighting at your side once more, Scion. Our operations invariably succeed when you're around. And victories are wont to pave the road to greater coin. Now, 
this detached force we've set we've been sent to eliminate has split into smaller squads the better to conceal themselves within the terrain the hereabouts I imagine we'll need to split up ourselves as well to cover more ground and make sure we root out all those would-be raiders and seeing as you're an army unto yourself I've assigned you your own areas to scout and clear of the enemy soldiers. Aye, right, this will be a simple search and destroy. We'll run the booze back here when the task is done. Happy hunting, Scion. Oh gosh. I'm all alone? No, I got blood paw. We're good. So it looks like our first little bit's over this way. Midgar, come on. You want to spy on me? You get to see what we're going to do. Oh, oh, they got a big beast up in here. Ooh. Took him down that quick. Look at that. That's pretty good. I think this is still level 50 plus, though. Next one. Nope, not this way. Are you part of my. Nope, but we'll take you out just the same. Alright, for heart Vanguard. Cohort Papo Maculus, whatever that is. I could not tab target it for us. And a Reaper. Alright, that's two down. You there. Take a seat. Help my guys out on the battlefield a little bit. Clear out some of this roof rack. Like you said, I'm an army on to myself. You seem grim, Sion. I take that to mean that between us, more than a few Garleans won't be making it back to the Castro. The Imperials, though, they certainly made us earn our pay. I would be a happy man if I never had to tussle with another of those Magitek horrors. It is time we bid this war-torn land farewell. I will contact the fourth and let Lieutenant Aline know the west is now clear. I would appreciate if you would go do the same when you report to Lieutenant Elstein. Alright, we can do that. So we may have just saved this plant and pushed back the Garlelians again. They just keep on coming, don't they? Ooh, the Haven's Turn seasonal event has begun. We'll have to check that out. Lieutenant Poker, what news of Garlelians? I beat them all, single-handedly. The raining parties on a moor, then? Excellent. The Alam Amagina engineers would be most relieved to hear that the plan is no longer in any plant is no longer in any immediate danger. Thank you again for your assistance. And on the counteroffensive is complete. Alright, thanks for joining me. That's it for today. Nice tick, and we will be back another day with another quest. Y'all take care.